Mr. Math here, thanks for watching my videos. Be sure to like and subscribe and remember to click the bell icon to be notified of updates. Hello again viewers, welcome back to Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles 2. We are here in the Emperor of Empire of Morardane. And I'd like to note that this music here in this area sounds like something off from a Mario Kart track. That's what it sounds like to me. It's the kind of music you'd have playing while you're racing a car or a motorcycle. So yeah, this makes me think of a Mario Kart track. Granted, I almost never play Mario Kart, so maybe I don't know what I'm talking about, but... Well, that's just what it sounds like to me. <laughs> and second, there was something I forgot to do back when we were in Argentum in the previous episode. So, let's do a skip travel really quickly. And hopefully the item that I want is available. Phew. That was a slog. Oh hey, there's That's a merc mission here. Kinda. Can't believe this. We're we gonna have to cancel negotiations now? Is something wrong? Some Lysat found their way into our cargo hold. Would, would you believe it? We were supposed to be starting business talks, but I can't exactly send the ship out now. I asked our general security to sort it out, but they got scared and ran off. Well, someone's got to take care of this. We'll see what we can organize. Now that, my friends, would be absolutely puka. You look like you could handle them. Well, best of luck. Okay, Merc mission. So I hear someone seriously vandalized the water tower in Torgoth. <laughs> Naturally, I felt I should do something to chip in. Any respectable Gormati would do the same. I already sent them over some iron, so here's hoping they'll be able to restore it. But who'd do a thing like that anyway? Was it that Torna bunch that everyone's been talking about? Uh... Yeah, let's not go too deep into that. Anyway, the Nopox Hobby Store. Let's see, does he... Let's see if he has it. Ah, uh, he doesn't. Darn it. There's another item here that shows up after you do a Merc mission. I was hoping I had done the correct mission. And it looks like I haven't. That's a shame. Let's see. So it should be about 12 more minutes for the current mission to come back. Oh no, we're down to 9 minutes now. Okay. Well, while I'm waiting for that, let's just get back to... More ordain. We have some monsters to kill. We can do that while we're waiting for that uh, Merc mission to come back. Phew. That was a slog. Now just go. Back to the awesome Mario Kart music. And we got a sandstorm now. Oh, oh well. We have plenty of markings on the compass, so we know where all the monsters we need to exterminate can be found. Wait a second, those Urchons? Come out, come out! Isn't it great we can get all this stuff right out of the ground? I have literally never seen Urchons here in this area, and now there's some right over there. Huh. Must be the weather condition. I don't remember ever having a sandstorm here before. It must have sensed our skill. Oh, for the love of it. Go away. New enemy in the mix. Uh. Okay. Get over here. Come on. Just so. There we go. Let's show him a thing or three. Okay. 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 Okay.
Alright, that's one. Yeah, it must be the weather conditions that have lured out the urchons. I have literally never seen them out here before. And I don't remember ever having a sandstorm here before come out, either. Come out. I adore fishies. So shiny and cute. How are there fish here? Sand salmon? What, salmon that live in the sand, really? Okay. And there's a heart to heart here. And another salvage point. Let's go ahead and use it. Oh, I can't wait. Hey. Hey. Time. Hey. All right. Well, that's an easy one. Oh, I love the smell of salvage. Well, that's a decent result. Okay, time to take you down. Nia fell off the cliff. Seriously, Nia? It's getting tough. Okay. Boy, I messed up that stuff. That Okay, well, um, don't tell her then. Treasure acquired. Alright, that should do the trick. Heart to heart. Alright. Uh, sure. Rex Rex, Tora have to ask for friend as fellow man's man. Tora want to gain understanding of life as adventurer. As an adventurer? Rex Rex is role model of Tora. That's why Tora want to learn everything he can about being Rex Rex. This is all very sudden, Tora. What's going on? Come um, now, Rex. Don't feel too important. He just wants to talk. In any case, it's not so common for Master Pan to ask something so directly. Exactly! Tora being earnest like never before. <laughs> Tora submit as evidence this direct and flinching eye contact. Napon have wacky looking eyes. I mean, they literally look like stuffed animals with the, how they're all just one color. Wow, your pupils are really dilated. <laughs> That's what you get staying up all night. All right, tonight Master Pond go to bed early. Me, 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 me. Enough! Tora's eyes are worried of Tora. It not matter. This important. Tora want to be like Rex Rex. Rex Rex, please teach Tora. Uh, I'm not sure which one is a better result.
I do know how it goes. If I choose this one, he starts giving Tora pointers on how to be a salvager. But if he does this one, then it shows he understands better what Tora is actually asking for. So, okay, I'll go with this one. Maybe it's better if Nia teaches you. Okay, so you want to know about being a driver, right? Right. Does it bother Master Pawn when someone say he no good at weapon pass? Of course it bother Tora. I mean, weapon pass is crucial element of driver blade coordination. If someone say me not so great at that, Tora's self-esteem plunge is par for course. I know where you're coming from, but... Uh, maybe that's all the more reason to ask Nia. She's the experienced one around here. Meh, Tora get it. We'll ask and come back. Nia just say, with time, body of driver learned to do it by muscle memory. Answer seems somewhat... dismissive. She's probably not wrong, though. Ah, oh, that's a shame. Hey, but maybe I can still help. I think Pyra and I manage okay, so... Actually, Nia referred to Rex Rex as well. Poppy believed the kid's green as freshly mowed grass himself, were her exact words. Seriously? Again, she's not wrong. That's what she thinks of me. Oh, chin up, Rex Rex. Indeed. Have much time to live and learn. Yeah, we'll get there. He says he'll help, but then he's the one who needs pepping up. <laughs> okay. So the Merc mission ought to be back pretty soon. Where am I exactly? We returned. Aha! All friends returned safely! And the sandstorm's gone, so it looks like the urchons are gone with it. This is what happens. Poppy, initiate rest mode! Well, that's a pretty vague thing to say, Wolfric. This is what happens. That literally fits every single situation in the entire world. <laughs> Feels good. Zami is nearly at her limit until we get to the point where we can unlock this. With this power. Okay. And yeah, this is one of the ice blades. Oh. From strength to strength. I think, this, I think this is one of the other ice blades. Yep, this is the other ice blade. She only gets ice mastery level 2. That's kind of a shame. The other one gets level 3, but she only gets level 2. Still, that should be good enough for most things. Ice mastery isn't that common, but there are a few field skill checks I already haven't been able to do because I didn't have any. Okay, let's see here. Cooking display. I think this is the one I need. If this is the one that puts that extra item in the board game shop. I'm pretty sure this is it. Alright, let's do it. Fleet of foot, expeditionist, knock on wisdom. Okay, that means I have to send... Uh, Boreas, because he has both fleet of foot and knock on his You need my help? And let's see, who has expeditions? Oh, a female blade, who I happen to need. And both of these guys have expeditions. Best of luck for us. Alright, so now I need three knuckle claws. So let's sort by weapon type. Knuckle claws, where are you? There we are, knuckle claws. Okay, so 
one of them is the Ice Blade And Korra? Hmm. Yeah, let's go ahead and send Korra. Ooh, I love going on trips. Oh, don't worry. I won't talk your ear off. There's work to do. And Windmaster. Yeah, let's get more of that. Got it. Okay, let's go. And let's make Korra the leader. Everyone, come join the Breeze Shooters! We'll do great! Good luck! Right. That's gonna take 38 minutes. So it'll be a while. But, eh, I can wait. Alright, Rex. Let's put Wolfric back on. Sorry, I get you get benched again. It sounds fun. All right. So Wolfric needs more trust. And he has super strength, so I might be able to open the door to the warehouse over in uh, Argentum. But let's not do that quite yet. Just so. Okay, time to take Ready? you down. Tora Humphrey is coming for them. Ha! Okay. Yeah, yeah. Gotcha. Now, let's show them yeah. you really need. Please, 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 Deer things get replaced by urchins. All right. I don't get how that works, but eh, I'm no ecologist. What do I know about that kind of thing? Come out, come out. Isn't it great we can get all this stuff right out of the ground? All right. There we go. Nuke Skeeter, get over here. Ah, too far away. Just there so. We go. All right, lure him over here and let's show him a thing or three. Spin it. I just oh, my oh, my my protocol activated. Okay, Cora, do level one. Where did the bonnet come from? Stupid animal, go away. Why not? Hey, Nia, I just found the shiniest trinket. You want to see? Hey, Nia? Yeah, yeah, I'll check it out later. You're such a child sometimes. Okay, so let's get the wolf over here. Do it like I showed you, and you'll be okay. Just watch this quietly. Sure. Make haste and retreat. So back. I'm not sure. You fight power with the power of friendship. Rolling wasn't ready for the driver combo. If I had been, I could have smashed him down. 
Okay. Lure? I'm hit. Okay, nice and far away from his friend. Yeah. No one can stop us now. Oh my God. Okay. Oh my God. 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 Oh my Finally did a driver combo for real. You have to be next time. No worries. I bet I can learn something to help a salvaging too. All right. Whew. My first full driver combo. Break, topple, launch, smash. Okay, bring it on. Spinning smash. I can take two at once. Well, on second thought, not that I can't take them, but just so they'll call for help when they get down to like one third HP. If I pull them away, he won't be able to call for help. Let's show him a thing or three. <laughs> Rolling smash! Rolling that's where he tried to call for help. Oh, darn it. He came in and... Okay. Okay, Mia, if you can get up to level 2 with water. Good, and now I can use Rock. Your flames shall win! Howl! Play combo, third stage. Awesome. Dead of winter topple. Dead of winter topple! Your way. I like your attitude. Alright. That worked out exceedingly well. Okay, where's the rest of these guys? You're not one of them. Okay, there's one. And hit! Watch yourself, Rex! Spin! Just one of them! Quietly! Don't you 
use of it now. Sure, I know. Please leave. I'm too sure. You don't stand a chance to get back. Let's give him a friendly treatment. Happy Alpha. Rush down. Rolling smash. Don't let him go. Okay. Okay. Pirate, do level two. Why not? And it died before I could actually land it. That's fine. Okay, seriously, what? Where are these things? Not in the nest, are they? No, they're not. Where are all these things? Okay. Let's show him a thing. There's right one of these. Rex, let's go. Rolling smash. Where's everyone else? Spinning. Cut out. Sword back. What are you doing? Make peace and retreat. Go for it. Oh no, you don't. Right. So don't do that. Why not? Yeah. 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 So all of a sudden, all the markings that were on the map are gone, except for the one. That's kind of weird. Eh, whatever. I guess I just have to go back and talk to the guy now. That's why there's only one marking left. What have we here? Isn't it great we can get all this stuff right out of the ground? Yeah, Mario come out, Kart come out. Isn't it great we can get all this stuff right out of the ground? And you know, this place even kind of looks like a Mario Kart track. With all the narrow passages and choke points and whatnot. Now, I don't think they're going to put something like this in Mar I don't think they're going to put this in Mario Kart 8. I'm pretty sure that ship be sailed. But maybe when Mario Kart 9 comes around. Whenever that is. Oh, oh, friends return. No more need for worry. Everything sorted out. Oh, ho, capable driver really in class of own when it comes to speediness. Time is money. That means speed is more money. Value of life is measured by contents of bank account. Man. Really, truly. And so, having said why saying, Fididi departs speedily to deliver wares to Alba Kavanich. No time for idle prattle. Thanks, friends. Okay. Now that he's sure the road to Alba Kavanich is safe, Fididi is making his way to the capital with his wares. Alright. Okay. Yes, Wolfric. Good show, my man. My heart beats faster. Okay, so super strength. Wolfric's favorite pouch item, staple foods. Okay. Just ply him with four slices of bread. I can do that. Oh, and literature, huh. Okay. Defeat a poison brog in Oriah. Defeat supercharged Alfonso in Gormont, yeah. That is a unique monster. And it's one of the measures I have of how much I've improved at this game. 
because during my first playthrough, I tried, you know, I fought him, and I could not for the life of me beat him at all. He just did too much damage for me to take him down. But now I can out-damage him because I know the system better. So yeah, I can beat Supercharged Alfonso pretty dependably. Especially now that I'm, what, like 10 levels higher than him? What level am I? 27, 27, 20, okay, so I'm 7 levels higher than him, so yeah, he wouldn't be too much of a challenge. I'm tempted to go do it. Actually, what I'm really tempted to do is open up that blasted warehouse over in Argentum. I'm pretty sure. Meh, long journeys make Dora tired. What Actually, will we find? I'm pretty sure I'm going to need um, uh, Boreas before I can do this. Uh, okay, so I can't get... I can't buy food from him right now because he's too busy. I have to come back at night. I could switch the clock tonight, but instead, let's just go to the other open store. Rumbletum Canteen. Juicy Samod. Alright. Okay. Open up Rex's pouch. Oh. Pouch number two is empty. Okay. I love this. I love this. I love this. I love this. Okay. There we go. Super strength level two. I understand now. All right. That should give me... Four levels of super strength, I believe. Poppy should have two. No, she only has one. Oh, dear. Oh, and she also needs four staple foods. Huh. All right, Tora, what have you got in your pouches right now? Two sweeties, huh? All right, then. Four more of these, please. Okay, sparkle sugar or blossom custard? Both about the same. Alright. Well, sparkle sugar can go. If Tora buried in these, he could die happy! Even Poppy can smell such delicious scent. If Tora buried in these, he could die happy! Even Poppy can smell such delicious scent. So it was already marked on her... type chart. That means I've used it at least once before. But only once, apparently. Tora buried in these, he could die happy! Even Poppy can smell such delicious scent. Okay, does that do it now? No. Huh. 
Well, fine. If I guess Tora I did it for something knees, else. He could die happy. Even Poppy can smell such delicious scent. There we go. So now I have four levels of super strength. Two on Poppy, two on Wolfric. Poppy's computational power increased. Alright then. So I don't know what I need to do for this one. Hit the specified score in Tiger Tiger. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've already done that. Wait a second, how much more trust? Wow, she's almost there for her level 4 key affinity. Wowie. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I need Boreas to come back before I can open the door of the warehouse. But I can at least check. Up. No crabbles allowed. Oh, thing or three. Rolling smash. Our emotions are in tune, Rex. I like your attitude. Okay. All right. So I definitely have enough super strength. I don't think I have enough Nopon Wisdom. I think I need Boreas to come back. <laughs> Poppy power! Leave Nopon to Poppy! Uh... I need two more levels of Nopon Wisdom. I don't think Boreas would be enough, actually. There's Boreas. There's Boreas. Oh, I can't check his affinity chart. Nopon Wisdom, level one. Yeah, that's not enough. I need two more levels. Ha. Fantastic. Okay. How do I take care of this? Okay, yeah, this one's actually pretty easy to grind out. Once I open up her level 4 key affinity, I can just go back and forth between two different Nopon, and there's lots of them here in Argentum. Just keep going back and forth between two, the same two different Nopon and talk to each of them over and over again, and in just a couple minutes I can have this. But first I have to actually get the trust for her key affinity. Ah. <sighs> Okay, that's actually not too difficult now that I think of it. Let's see, do I have uh, another staple food? I do not. Do I have a musical instrument? I do not. Blast it. Okay, what if I just put a sweetie in her in the pouch? Do I have any fizz juice? Oh man, I don't have anything! Blast! Yeah, her favorite items will get her trust up faster than anything else. So maybe I should buy a couple fizz juices and just give her those. Okay, central exchange. And we're you. Let us go. Fizz juice. Two of these. And then drop them into Taurus pouch. Woo! Super tasty treat for Tora! Yum yum! Resistance protocols deactivated. Okay, so how much trust did that give her? Only ten. Woo! 
Woo! Super tasty treat for Tora! Yum yum! Resistance protocols deactivated. Yeah, only ten. Huh. Okay, two more. Super tasty treat for Tora! Yum yum! Resistance protocols deactivated. Alright. Woo! Super tasty treat for Tora! Yum yum! Resistance protocols deactivated. Okay, and now just replace it with the uh, sparkle sugar. That should do it. Haha! -ha! Ta -da. New abilities acquired. Okay. You know, I should have checked. Do I have any other blades with Nopon Wisdom? I do not. They are the only ones. Okay, so I have to get Poppy up to level 3, and then I have to have Boreas come back. Let's see. I could speak to the store clerks down there, but that would take a while. Oh, Merc Mission. Survey team send word of ship that have impertinence to do business without approval of Trade Guild. If unlicensed trade allowed to continue, Marketplace end up in complete shambles. And then that it! End of Merchant Age! Lost in history! How about friends sneak on board ship and leave them up creek without paddle? We can help you out if you've a mind to let us handle it. Splendid, splendid. Healy Healy, expect to hear good news in your future. Okay. So there are two Nopons right up here. Sneaky Sneaky and Talulu. And I think there's two of them right out here, also. Yeah, right next to each other. Look at this. Lamuli. What cylinders friends use when go salvaging? More pricey cylinders is hard to justify purchase, Lamuli know. But pricey cylinder also much better quality, so likely to get better treasures. So when friends have money to spare, Lamuli think it's better to stretch a little and buy pricey cylinder sometimes. Okay, so how many more times do I have to talk to an Opon to satisfy this ability. Uh, 38. Okay. Alright, so I'm not going to bother reading these things. Since they're right next to each other, turn right around. Yeah, this is a little bit tedious, but it'll only take a um, couple minutes at most. All I have to do is just keep mashing the A button. What does Gigebi actually say? Lemuli starts saying he wants to become salvager, but me telling him is a bad idea. We need all security personnel we can get right now, so no one get away with vile deeds like Chairman Banner. Besides, Lemuli is dozy pawn, always late for work and make mistake, not cut out for a dangerous job like salvaging. That's fair. Personally, I'm kind of the same way. I don't think I would want to do Rex style salvaging. Not unless I had a. 
pack of hard guys to back me up whenever monsters popped in. And you know, I like how that actually does have a story explanation. You know, in the very beginning of the game, we saw that when Rex pulled up that box, that, uh, that uh, monster was living inside of it. That's another thing about Xenoblade Chronicles 2 that I like. Everything actually has a story explanation. The fact that you can't just constantly spam driver arts and you have to wait for them to, re to recharge, even that has an explanation. Vandom explained it to us when we first met him. Aha! There we go. Feel stronger. All right, so now I just need one more level of Nopon Wisdom, which means I need uh, Boreas to come back from the Merc mission. Only seven more minutes. Okay. Still, that's seven minutes I don't really want to spend here. All right, let's go back to War Dade. And just open the way to the actual city now. Long journeys make Dora tired. What will we find? So as soon as Boreas gets back, I should be able to open the warehouse. What have we here? Isn't it great we can get all this stuff right out of the ground? Which is convenient, actually, because Boreas is the one who needs the warehouse. Yeah, it's perfectly reasonable to have him involved in opening the place up since he's the one who's going to be using here? it. Isn't it great we can get all this stuff right out of the ground? Alright, so here we are. Cargo transportation zone. The industrial lifts on the left, lift for people is further in. Ilmina. Hi there. This is a storage area for goods to be transported into Alba Cavendish. Moradine's main exports are salvage materials and manufactured goods. Our food, though, is mostly imported. Without the money our tech brings in, we'd barely be able to feed ourselves. There's always a ton of imported goods sitting around here ready to be carried into the city. The freight elevator needs permission to use, but the personal personnel elevator is open to the public. Now, you probably don't want to hang around in a dusty old place like this. Hurry along into the city. Yellow barrels! That's not going to be important at all. And... Here's the freight elevator that they won't let me use. That's stingy of them. Let's see... I thought there were some treasure troves around here, but I guess not. Alright. Here's the personnel elevator. Okay. Up we go. Oh, there's a guy down there to talk to. Right, so. As I mentioned in the previous episode, our goal is to get to the Indol Praetorium. So we went to Argentum to get a ship here to Moradain, and now we need to wait for a ship from here to Indol. So we're kind of stuck here for a while. 
And yeah, the chapter three here really isn't all that great at keeping you reminded that that's why you're here. Things just kind of happen and you get swept up into events and that whole reason for being here gets, well, neglected, I would say. Nira Nira. Hey, old friends, Nira Nira on little touristy excursion to more Ardanian Empire. Is that right? Alba Kavanich is really is splendid place. Air is clear and food exquisite. Huh? Meh? I get it backward. <laughs> Oops, that happened from time to time. Uh, near and near, I'll probably go look around somewhere now. But much thanks for saying hello. Another dessert shop. We'll have to check that out in a bit. Hmm. Nira Nira seems rather interested in us. Oh. So this is the Imperial Capital. Such a big city! Maybe their place is selling rare junk parts for upgrading Poppy! Time to go look! Master Pawn, Poppy would rather use new parts if possible. <laughs> meh, meh! Is that you there, Tora? I've not seen Tora in long time. Remember me? Mui Mui? Huh? Why random old guy know Tora's name? Oh, Tora not remember me at all. It's Mui Mui. I was assistant of Professor Su Su, your grampy pod. That's him, all right. Oh, you that old Mui Mui guy! Of course, Tora, remember. Mui Mui should have said to start with. Mui Mui did say. Oh, right. Mui Mui not very interesting, so Tora forgot he exists. <laughs> Tora? That's not very nice. No, no, I do not blame Tora. Tora was very young back then. Not surprising he forget. Besides, Master Pawn was quite distracted just now, only thinking of how to upgrade Poppy. Why, could it be? This looked like artificial blade. Mui Mui right! Tora studied Grumpy Pawn and Dada Pawn's blueprints carefully and finished construction. Meh, meh! How wonderful! If only Professor Su Su still here to see results of hard work. Mui Mui, you have any idea where Dadapon went? That day when the lab was attacked, Mui Mui was out on errand. When I got back, Professor Su Su's body was lying there. <sighs> but. There was no sign of Professor Tatazo. I see. Even Mui Mui not know. Do not feel down, Master Pon. We will find Data Pon someday. Though no evidence for this hypothesis. <laughs> anyway, Mui Mui apologized for interrupting your trip when you just arrived in city. Friend of Mui Mui run an inn just up ahead. Place with famous hot springs. If you like, Mui Mui can try to get you discount. Mui Mui is best friend! <laughs> right. Hmm. There's Nira Nira again. We're back! Oh, right. things went well. So that's Gloria hey, returned. Look, it was really tough. Like when we were done, we went to the guy and we said we're done, but he just said go eat dinner. And we couldn't like refuse, so we ate and ate, but there was like a poison mushroom in the food, and so Thanks for getting it done. <laughs> Let's try this power out next time. Okay, Cora. 
and chorus key affinities only require trust. There's no question mark, question mark, question mark on any of these. So yeah, she's a good one to keep on uh, Nia. almost complete. Only has one node left to fill. Okay, ooh. Merc level one, next. 500 to 500. I've got that. Okay. I should go back to Garfont and fix that up before I do any more Merc missions. Wow, all of a sudden there's a bunch of things I need to do. see here. Yeah, a bunch of things I need to do. Yep. Just leave it to Boreas. Okay, Rock. Sorry, but I need to have Boreas on board for the time being. And now what? Um, Alright, so let's switch from Ursula to Korra. It's been a long time coming. Always cute and fierce, though. And, yeah, Tor doesn't have anyone except Poppy. Because he cannot resonate with core crystals. Alright, what's the time? Wow, the world, world has hard many today. amazing places in it. Perhaps rest and enjoy view for a bit. Okay, I, there's someone I want to find. I don't know if they're still there. Underived. Uh, <laughs> All in one piece. I don't know where to go for it. Uh, hmm. No, it's not over here. Last time I kind of turned around. They're up on the roof of one of the buildings, but I don't remember which building. This person I want to find. Underived. <laughs> All in one piece. No, it's not here. Here either. Let's see, where was it? I'm pretty sure it's, it's going to be too late by the time I get there. This person is only out during the late afternoon, early evening. There's Hardhay Palace. Pretty grand location. This is looking a bit familiar. Oh. Uh. Yeah, this is the place. The Admar Storage Zone, yes. Of course, the person I'm looking for is probably not here anymore because it's way too late in the evening. up here. Darn it, I always have problems with this jump. Oh, come on. Get on the box, thank you. Okay, there we go. Uh, 
Yeah. It's way too late. Okay. Well, we can fix that easily enough. Miney, that's who I was looking for. Something bothering, friend. The cloud sea's great, don't you think? It's so huge and beautiful. I want to become a salvager, you know. I got to try it. I got to try it out once years back. Didn't find anything, even though they let me use a silver cylinder. But even so, it was so much fun. Don't you think it'd be great to be able to do a job you enjoy in a place you love? Absolutely. I know, right? It's just a dream for me right now, though. My family don't have the cash to buy any salvaging gear. Well, tell you what. I'm always looking out for up-and-coming salvagers. Here's a gift. A golden cylinder. For me? Really? I don't even know how many years it would take me to earn the money for something like this. Just looking at it is making me want to become a salvager even more. Yeah, someday I'll use this and salvage something really good. I'll haul up some incredibly rare treasure, sell it off in Argentum, and use that money to buy a house in Gormont where we can all live. Gotta keep dreaming big, right? Thank you so much for this. I swear I'll become a salvager someday. Yep, wanted to perform that good deed. Now there's a few other things to take care of. Now I can open the warehouse over in Argentum. I have enough Nopon Wisdom equipped that I can Let's rest open the place up. So, shall we? And hey, the owner of the warehouse said that if I could open it up without paying, I could use it. So. Warehouse back door. <laughs> Open Poppy sesame. Power. I know Nopon's like the back of my Leave uh, Nopon to Poppy. Uh, uh, there we go. Now there's a treasure trove here. You're all mine. Common core crystal, fire defense up, and a fair amount of money. These are boxes for stashing food that I prepared at mock speed just for me. The plan is to fill them up with all kinds of food I like. Oh, I see. The more food I have handy, the better I can concentrate on battling. First up, let's collect some cooked foods. Leave it to me. Boreas's food stash, cooked food box. So... Yeah, I have three Armu T-Bone steaks. Don't have anything else though. Oh wait, I have Braised Cloud Sea Shark. <laughs> I've had that forever. It was delivered to me at the very beginning of the game. Okay, well. So I need to amass 100 points worth of cooked food. That's nine. And that's 18. So let's see. Hmm. Where can I get these? Uh, I wonder what can I get here? Here at the Fishy Fishy restaurant. And we're you. Let us go. Okay, Kitoto, what have you got? 
Grilled anchor tail. That's something the Boreas wanted, isn't it? Goldmouth warehouse. I can just skip travel straight there now. Off we go. What will? Yep, he wanted this. Okay. All right. I'm up nearly halfway, so I need 52 more. It can get a bit expensive, but let us go. I have the money for the one at least. And back to the warehouse. Off we go. What will we find? Okay, so I need 22 more. So, eight more of those will fill it up. And where you? Let us go. Okay. So it was a couple thousand G to fill up the cooked food stash. And where you? Not just. All right. Key affinity reward level two for Boreas. No more will fit. Okay. Keep getting bigger and better. All right. Okay, so now he wants for level three key affinity ward lots of desserts. Okay. Churros, huh? I can get those in at the Fonts of Mima Theater House. I'm not giving him the Narsapair jelly. I simply am not. That's way too good a pouch item to throw away like that. There is a dessert shop in Alba Cavanach. Uh, I think this will take me pretty much right to it. Phew. That was a slog. Let us go. Okay. I don't remember, was he looking for any of these? Shoot, I should have written it down or something. Well, regardless, these are pretty good items right here, so let's get 10 of them anyway. Even if he doesn't want them in his stash, I can use them for pouch items. Journeys make to 
sure are tired. Come on, textures, pop what in already. There we go. Okay, he does want the Sky Jewel Tart. Whoa, seven points for those. Okay. That's definitely worth it. Brought me up to 70 points. Five more of them, and that's done. Anything else? No, just those. No, I'm not using the fruity rice balls right now. Oh. Okay, there we go. Boris is level is three. Already? Please consider taking a rest. Dessert box. No more will fit. Okay. That's level three unlocked. I'll keep getting bigger and better. Plant based food. Box for veggies. Okay, these are the ones that I bought from the store in Torgoth that I now own. Might as well pop them in there, since I'm never going to use them. Three points for that one. Three points for that one. Three points for that one. Five points for that one. Okay. Well, let's go back and buy some more of those. Tired. What will we find? Okay. Tenny. Pre release salad, please. Ten of. And then let me think. That'll get me up to sixty four. That'll get me up to 94. So just two more. And that should be enough. Okay. Let's rest the spell. So? Shall we? It always looks funky that it takes so long for the textures to pop in like that. Okay, so... Okay, there we go. Got his level four. Locked for veggies. No more will fit. Yeah. I'll keep getting bigger and better. And now I need to fill it up with drinks. Okay. Boreas is so easy to unlock. I mean, look at all this. I've already got him up to level 4, and I'm about to get him up to level 5. Fizz Juice and Chunky Juice. I can get both of those right here. Right here in Argentum. Just 
Twelve Brother Sister Pond have them. Off we go! What will we find? Fizz juice. Chunky juice. Back to the warehouse. And we're you. Now just go. Oh, that's only giving me one point. Oh, wow. Okay. That's... Uh, frozen Odifa Fizzy Lassie. I wonder if I can get those yet. Let's check the uh, cafe in Torgoth. See if they have either of those. Let's rest the spell. So, shall we? Okay, Cafe Savvy, what have you got? Oh, they don't have either of them. Hmm. Okay. Maybe the uh, drinks counter in uh, Garfont Village? Log. Now just go. There it is. Well, well, well. If I got a beaut of a drink for you, I worked in the service of the high court, so I know my stuff. Blah, blah, blah. Fizzy Lassie. Okay. This ought to get me a few more points. It's a, uh double red diamond rarity so it should be worth probably five maybe seven no not gourmand argento there we go I mean, as long as you have the money boreas is Key affinities are so Let's easy to open spell. up. So, shall we? I've spent, I don't know, maybe uh, 15,000 G so far. Only three points for this one. Uh, where's the frozen Odifa? Well, that's just one diamond rarity, so probably wouldn't be much better. Okay. Alright, back to Garfont to get more of that. So, ten more of those will get me up to eighty. Let's rest the spell. Eighty points out of so, hundred. Shall we? Ten more of these two drinks here will get me the rest of the way to 100. So? So yeah, I've spent about somewhere from 15 to 20,000 G. Not a small sum, but in the grand scheme of things, it won't take me very long to make it back. So? Shall we? And now I'm going to have Boreas's entire affinity chart wide open. Okay. 
<laughs> all right, I have all four of his stashes filled in. And now, his entire affinity chart just wide open. I keep getting bigger and better. This new move is too cool. Now, another interesting thing about Boreas, when you open up a node on his affinity chart, it tells you a pouch item that one of the other characters will be into, either one of the drivers or one of the blades. And to open up the rest of them, you just spam pouch items. Staple foods, seafood, you know, sweets, drinks, vegetables, meat, and that's it. And then for his field skills, it's mostly trust-based. There is one based on a heart-to-heart. -heart. And then Napon Wisdom is just, you know, mostly speaking to Napon, just like with Poppy. So his chart is really easy to fill in. It can be pretty expensive, but it's easy. Really, you just send them off on a lot of Merc missions and you can do it for free. But, you know, if you don't want to wait on Merc missions, you can just start spamming pouch items and you can have pretty much his entire chart filled in as soon as you open the warehouse here. You know, if you have the money to spend on that. Okay. Wait, have I given Wolfric any... Ox scores I have, all right. Yeah, we're set to go. Okay, so... Yeah, now I can just send Bore off, Boreas off on Merc missions, and pretty much all of his chart will get filled in for me. So I don't really have to have him equipped to Rex anymore. I can bring Rock back out. Rock, pleased to meet you. All right. Now that was definitely worth the time. Okay, so next thing we need to do... No, not Gormot. Darn it, I keep making that mistake. Next thing we need to do is take care of the Merc group. Because we've amassed enough Merc points to advance to level 2. journeys make Tora tired. What so, will we find? we just talk to you there, and it'll open up the quest to advance the Merc group. But that's going to be in the next episode, because I'm out of time for now. Viewers, thank you very much for watching this episode of Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles 2. In the next episode, as I just said, we will advance the Merc group a bit further. That shouldn't take us very long, so once that's done, Probably we'll head back to more Ardain and see about taking care of business there. See you later.